The numbers of 33 unforced errors, and then you had a, a smash at the net which you hit straight to her, and then towards the end of the third set you had a double fault and then missed a, um, a drive volley. Do you not have to look at yourself a little bit about how you cope with these big points? Because it's all very well saying it's a lot to do with your opponent, but there were key points when you perhaps could have done better. Is that in your professional tennis opinion? No, that's just as a watching <laughs> spectator with everyone else in centre court willing you on. Okay. Um, again, I think... Uh, numbers uh, are IBMs. Okay, that, I mean, I, I don't think you need to pick on me in a, in a harsh way. I mean, I think... Uh, I think I'm I'm very open with you guys and I, I say how I feel out there and if, if you don't want to accept that answer or you don't agree with it, that's fine, but I still believe in the tennis that I play and I still believe in the way I competed and um, yeah, I don't have much else to say to your question. I'm just asking you as somebody who presumably wants to go on from here, learn from this and, and win a Grand Slam one day. Is it not something that you need? Please don't patronise me. I'm I, not I would have, no, no, you are in the way you're I'm asking. In the way that. you're asking your question, you are being quite disrespectful, and you are patronising me. I'm a professional competitor who did her best today, and that's all there is to that.